What did you want to talk to me about? I realize this is kind of a big ask, but I want to defend my WWE Championship against John Cena. Beating him would solidify my title reign and put me up there with some of the top champions of all time. So, any chance you can make that happen? You know, maybe give him one of those mandates to show up and face me? Yeah, I wish it was that easy. I mean, don't you think I've already tried to get Cena to appear on Raw before? He would bring instant star power along with a guaranteed ratings boost. But the reality is he's busy with various TV and film projects and isn't interested in a return right now. So it's pretty much a lost cause. If I were you, I'd focus on something else. I wouldn't be where I am today if I just quit any time I was up against some adversity. I'm going to get John Cena to come back to WWE and face me. And how are you going to do that? I'm going to take a little trip down memory lane and revisit some of Cena's career highlights. Maybe that will get his attention. And here's the man, the man who is one of the most accomplished stars in the history of WWE. Just one of the many reasons why he is the A-lister. And his opponent from Hollywood, California, weighing in at 221 pounds. The The Red Brand's rolling out the red carpet tonight as the current WWE Champion has invited none other than The Miz to Monday Night Raw to square off one-on-one. -on -one. It's a heck of a gambit, Michael. Arm ringer applied. Look out. He's on his heels a bit now. There's been plenty of action in this match. From the top. Oh, oh, piercing elbow. Here he goes. For the win. So this whole Cena thing, hate to say I told you so, but you know what? I don't hate it at all. 
I told you so. I know how it looks from your perspective, but I promise it's gonna work. I just need more time. And besides, I never said this would be easy. Fine. But if you don't get at least some kind of acknowledgement soon from Cena, then I'm pulling the plug. What's your next move? Spotlighting a major loss didn't seem to work, so I'm gonna go in the other direction. Oh yeah, I actually got wind of your idea for this already. Trying to replicate Cena's first WWE Championship win by beating JBL? Don't think it's going to matter, but I'll make it happen. A Hall of Famer and our former broadcast colleague, guys. A wrestling god. And his opponent from Dallas, Texas, weighing in at 290 pounds, J.B. Now here's JBL, a Triple Crown champion. He's held the WWE title, Intercontinental title, and U.S. title. He's a member of the WWE Hall of Fame. Fresh off a big win against The Miz, the WWE Champion will try to get John Cena's attention one more time tonight against one of Cena's former WrestleMania foes, JBL. JBL's a Hall of Famer that's to hinder him. Uh-oh. Hard -oh. sidekick. He's... Uh, here it comes, legendary. Give up now. Swallow your pride and submit. Just hang on. Hang on for just a little bit. That submission forces a tap out. was his dominant a Oh, there was a potential opening with Cena, and you blew it. I don't think it's over. Are you crazy? He turned you down and then you insulted him? We can forget about a match. He probably won't even come back for a simple appearance now. So thanks for that. I'm telling you, I think I struck a nerve with him. And a man like that is too proud to just let that go. Let me do one more thing to get his attention, and if this doesn't work, then I'll move on. You've already tried one more thing two or three times. He's gonna respect the fact that I won't give up. And then you'll get your star power and your ratings boost that you want so bad. Ugh, what do you wanna do? I want The Undertaker. What? Let me explain. Cena was in the exact same position I'm in with The Undertaker a few years ago at WrestleMania. He was so desperate for a match he bought a ticket and sat in the audience waiting. When Undertaker eventually did appear, Cena lost in five minutes. I remember all that. What's your point? I want to send Cena a final message by doing what he couldn't do at WrestleMania. I want to defeat The Undertaker. That's really pushing it, but I think I can make it happen. And if Cena sticks to his word and never answers your challenge, 
then at least I'll get the ratings boost I was looking for with The Undertaker. And if Cena does change his mind, then even better. All right. Looks like you got yourself a match against the Phenom. Look who's here. The Phenom has arrived. And demise awaits anyone who stands across the ring from the dead man. The Reaper walks among us. And his opponent from Death Valley, weighing in at 299 pounds, the Long. The WWE Champion has been on a roll, but tonight the champ will have to take his game to an entirely new level as he takes on the incomparable WWE legend, The Undertaker. It's the WWE Champion. Suplex, but that's not all. Uh oh, guys, and no good ever comes of this. Unfortunately, you are absolutely right, Michael. Okay, but boom, back drop, suplex. What a high angle right across the shoulders. What a punch. And the electricity of this moment is coursing through his veins. Wow. Undertaker retaliates. A nice shot by the Undertaker. Now one of the best strikers in the business. He's got him scouted. Scouted. Firm control. Oh, what a boot to the face. Undertaker's lost all power. The dead man is looking beatable. Hey, Byron, just like you. Straight jacket neck breaker. The Undertaker in a bad way. Hey, Byron, just like you. You never want to overlook an accomplishment like that, but I think the champion still has other things on his mind. John Cena, over the past few weeks, I've done everything I can to prove to you that I'm worthy of a match, that I'm worthy of your time. I mean, I just beat The Undertaker, which is something you couldn't do. So you know what? Maybe... Maybe I've been looking at this the wrong way. Maybe it's not about proving that I'm worthy of your time. Maybe you're not worth mine. Well, I have to agree with the WWE Champion here. It's time to move on from this whole John Cena thing. Wait a second. It's John Cena! The face of WWE has come home! I can't believe it. After weeks of unanswered challenges and then Cena himself saying it wasn't going to happen, the WWE Champion has gotten John Cena to return to Monday Night Raw. And there you have it. Cena is back for one thing, the WWE Championship. Hey, this is a matchup that no one thought we'd ever see. And now it looks like it's happening. This is going to be one for the ages.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Championship. In my estimation, the greatest of all time, the 16-time world champion, John Cena. There aren't too many people who would argue with you, Michael Cole. Introducing the challenger from West Newberry, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds, John Cena! And introducing the champion from London, England, weighing in at 223 pounds, he is the WWE Champion, That's what it's all about, the WWE Championship. The challenger wanted this opportunity, now he's got it. Well, it's always fun to go to the zoo until you fall into the lion's den. The challenger has better sharpened his teeth. Weeks and grueling battles have all led the WWE Champion to this moment. A chance to etch his name into the WWE history books against the one and only John Cena. Talk about box office. Two of the biggest draws in sports entertainment. Ooh. Went into the corner now. He's positioned up on that turnbuckle. I would not want to be him right now. Okay, top rope now. Terrible situation. DDT from the top rope. The challenger is in. Now a pin for the championship. One, two, three. And the champ retains. Introducing the challenger 
Welcome to what should be one of the most brutal championship matches we've ever seen between the defending WWE champion and one of the most decorated superstars in WWE history, John Cena, as they face off in a last man. Time to go to school. Figure four, since then, this could... Look at this, fighting desperately out of the figure four, successfully. Man, just a multitude of strikes. Uh -oh. Wow. Caught with a DDT. Delivers the leg drop. the perfect match never The following contest is an Extreme Rules match. Making his way to the ring from London, England, 
weighing in at 223 pounds, Big Money Dave. This former indie star learned the hard way. <laughs> I love this. An entrance befitting of a true superhero. And the best part about it, Saxton, is this isn't a movie. This isn't a comic book. This is real life. Not CGI, not special effects. Ricochet is the real deal. And his opponent from Paducah, Kentucky, weighing in at 190 pounds. This is a match where these WWE superstars take it to the max, to the extreme. There are no rules. As an agent of chaos, my shoulders down. Is it enough? And he gets the shoulder up. He's looking to get this match won in short order. Big kick. Firm control. Kick right to the face. Uh-oh. Targeting the arm to great effect. Producing a trampling. Oh, look at this. How pretty is this? Backpack face buster. Wow. Uh-oh. Arm side kick. Chair. Right in the kisser. Oh, my God. And the damage is just going put into the barricade. Oh, no. What could this be? Oh, don't do this. I'm out of the barricade. Been put on the defensive. Ricochet to wind down. And Ricochet needs to create separation. Puts him on the table. What does he have in mind? We're about to find out. Oh, look at this. All packaged. This has gone too far. This match definitely isn't for the faint of heart, Saxton, or table enthusiasts. All right, sliding back in. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. No contest. Never a doubt. Barely a moment's suspense. This match is